It was a unanimous decision. Five constitutional court judges nullify May's presidential election result, saying Peter Mutarika did not win a second term. Fresh elections have to be held within 150 days. Opposition leaders who were caught welcomed the ruling. We're happy with the judgment. Uh, justice has prevailed. And we shall make further comments uh, after reading the final judgment. Thank you. We came to seek justice. We just got it. Celebrations erupted in opposition strongholds. Judges said there were too many inconsistencies in May's election. Some people may have voted more than once. There was ballot stuffing and some figures were changed using typewriter correction fluid. Holding another election in a few months will be a logistical nightmare. Opposition supporters say they want guarantees that there will be no repeat of the widespread irregularities and vote rigging that damaged electoral credibility. In 2017, Kenya's Supreme Court annulled that country's presidential election because of irregularities. Malawi is now the second sub-Saharan country to have a presidential vote overturned. There will no longer be an attempt by any other party in the future possibly to simply do certain things underhand. And it will also emphasize the point that uh, you need to go back and invest into our electoral system. Should we continue on the first past the post? Or we should now start looking at 50 plus 1 or any other system that uh, would uh, eventually secure or assure of a free and fair election. For months there have been demonstrations in several parts of the country over May's disputed election. Some of those have been violent. Mutarika's ruling DPP party can appeal the constitutional ruling at the Supreme Court. No one from the party was willing to go on camera after Monday's constitutional court ruling. The country is tense. Earlier on Monday, the streets of the capital of Longwe were eerily quiet. Many people chose to stay at home, not sure what's going to happen next. How a rerun of elections is handled could improve or deepen Malawi's political and economic crisis. Harumutasa Al Jazeera, Lilongwe.